Get upside down Pilates uninterrupted with no commercials or ads. You can watch all the full one hour episodes of Upside Down Pilates on all your devices. Visit www.upsidedownpilates.com to sign up now. Aloha and welcome to Upside Down Pilates. Today we have a very special guest, one of my clients, the great Scott, Scott Cicada. So Scott's been working with me for a while now and he started out with some issues. We were having pain in our lower back and our right hip, yes? Um, and we've spent quite a bit of time strengthening his deep stabilizers in his center and what we discovered is that he has a little bit of um, a displacement of his ribs. His left rib goes left and his right hip goes right and they kind of twist away from each other. And that was putting some pressure on his lower back into his hip, and he's created some compensatory patterns in his hip, um, and he has a very specific area that is extremely weak compared to the rest of his body. Uh, and so we've been working on bringing the left rib to the right hip and strengthening the deep hip muscles and waking up all of his deep stabilizers and breathing and all of that type of stuff. And he's down to a few zings in his leg every now and again. And when he started, what would you say your pain level was? Okay, it was a nine. He says it was an eight or a nine when he started. And that was, I mean, that was quite a while ago, but um, it's been pretty significant, the, the decrease in his issues. I mean, it's not zero and he can go do whatever he wants he's got to do his exercises and come to Pilates and all that type of stuff but it's been a huge change thank God so we are going to show you where he's at right now with his workout and what we're doing with him in his solo lessons and know that a lot of the stuff we're doing now when he started he was not able to do any of it um, without it causing pain down his back and down his right leg. So a lot of the exercises were just he couldn't do them. So, Yay! Thank you for joining us, Mr. Scott. Oh yes, and my name's Lisa Oreck. I always forget to say that. Alright, we're going to start as usual with breathing. So remember, what this does for us is it fires up our transversus abdominis, which is our deep stabilizing muscle, our corset around our center. Some people call it our core. Um, as well as our lumbar multifidy muscles. We're sitting on the whoopee cushions or the sit fits or balance discs, I call them whoopee cushions, um, and that creates a bit of instability in the spine, so it's gonna fire up all of the multifidy muscles in the spine. And then we're gonna breathe and blow our pinwheel, and we're going to smile because the great Scott really enjoys this pinwheel breathing thing, like a lot of my clients. All right, here we go, nice big inhale and then exhale, one, inhale, and exhale, two, inhale, and exhale, three, inhale, and exhale, four, inhale, and exhale, five, halfway there, inhale, and exhale, six, inhale, and exhale, seven, inhale, and exhale, eight, inhale, and exhale, nine, last time, inhale, and ten, fantastic. We have to wait a moment so that his <coughs> carbon dioxide and oxygen ratio can rebalance in his brain and his blood, and then we will do the sniffs and the blows, so we, this is, uh, version of the traditional Pilates exercise 100s and we will s pulse sniff through our nose for five counts and then pulse blow through our mouth for five counts and we'll let the expert show us what it looks like and smile here we go sniff one two three four five blow two three four ten in two three four five out two three Four, twenty in two three four five out two three four thirty in two three four five out two three four 
40, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, 50, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, 60, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, 70, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, 80, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four, 90, in two, three, four, five, out, two, three, four. He made it. Fantastic. Okie dokie. We are going to move on to your hip lifts. All right. So hop off and then you can just lie down here on your back. And I am going to go and grab a pillow, the scoliosis pillows. All right, so these are little half inch, three quarter inch pillows that we use to help him shift his hips and his ribs together. So I'm gonna take one pillow and put it under his right hip which will help him encourage to bring his left hip down. And then I'm gonna put the other pillow underneath his left rib, and that will help him encourage to twist his right rib to the ground. So again, his left rib goes this way and his right hip goes this way. And by having the pillows there, it helps him to reach the opposite side down. And then it brings the connection of his left rib to his right hip and he loves this too. He will be in neutral the whole time. Bring his legs all the way together and we're gonna flex the feet. Good, and if it cramps, just lower down and shake it out and we'll keep going. All right, here we go, neutral pelvis and then arms down by the sides if you can. Inhale and exhale, lift the hips. Inhale and then lower the hips. Good, one, is it cramping? Inhale, not yet. Exhale, lift. His hamstrings will cramp. Inhale and exhale. Two. Inhale and exhale, lift. Inhale and exhale. Three. Good. Inhale and exhale, lift. Inhale and sit the hips down. Four. Inhale and exhale, lift, inhale, and set the hips down, five, again, inhale, and exhale, lift, inhale, and exhale, six, only four more, inhale, and exhale, lift, inhale, seven, three more, inhale, and lift, Inhale, and eight, two more. Inhale, exhale, lift. Inhale, and exhale, nine. Last one. Inhale, and lift. Inhale, and 10, and shake it out. And you can massage your tibialis anterior. So we have his feet flexed to help encourage his knees towards his toes and his toes towards his knees, and then encourage his hamstrings and his lower back to work harder. Um, but it can be very fatiguing. All right, are we ready for more fun? All right, we're gonna do the same thing in a little bit of turnout. So legs all the way together, flex the feet. Good, so you're gonna have your big toes and your heels ideally kissing and then you're just gonna open the knees about as wide as the shoulders and keep the big toes and heels together the best you can. And we're gonna do the same thing that we just did. All right, neutral pelvis. Inhale, exhale, lift. Good, inhale, and then crease at the hip and lower. And what Scott thinks about is keeping his right hip up as he lifts. Inhale, exhale, lift. Otherwise, it likes to drop down. Inhale, exhale, lower. Two, inhale, exhale, lift. Inhale, exhale, three. Inhale, and lift. Inhale, four. Inhale, and lift. And he's doing a great job keeping his spine nice and flat. 
five in his neutral spine. And lift, inhale, six, four more. Inhale, exhale, lift, seven, three more. Inhale and lift, so easy. Eight, two more. Inhale and lift, no comment, he says. And nine, one more. Inhale and lift. Inhale and exhale, 10. Very nice, shake it out. Upside Down Pilates Unlimited. Get Upside Down Pilates uninterrupted with no commercials or ads. For a limited time, we are offering a special early bird discount at less than 17 cents a day. And you can lock in your rate forever. We'll keep adding new lessons. At Upside Down Pilates Unlimited, you can watch all the full one hour episodes of Upside Down Pilates on all your devices. Roku, Apple TV, Android, select smart TVs, iOS, Amazon Fire Stick, the web, and more. Anywhere the Vimeo app is supported. The next best thing to taking lessons with me. Plus, this is a great way to help support the channel and help keep us making great content. Upside Down Pilates Unlimited, everywhere, anytime, commercial free, affordable. Visit www.upsidedownpilates.com to sign up now.